Hey there YouTube and a boy back with another video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can install TWRP custom recovery on your Redmi Note 3 Qualcomm edition. Hey guys, we should have our boy in this squad. So with that being said, let's get started. Okay, so as you guys can see here, this is my Redmi Note 3 and currently I'm running this Android Marshmallow on this Redmi Note 3. So I'll just show you what things do you need to do this whole TWRP installing process. So the first thing you need to go here in this Redmi Note 3 is, yeah. So the first thing is just clip your phone. Oh, sorry, <laughs> I just don't know. I hope you guys can see here right there. Let me increase the brightness. All right. Oops, the brightness. Yeah, I hope you guys can see it. Okay, now just go and let me just check is it's recording or not. Yeah, so just go here. Okay, just go in settings. Just go in about phone. Then just press this MIUI version as you can see here. I hope you guys can see you guys. Uh, okay and yeah please don't blame me for the quality press it for up to seven times just go back and then just go in additional settings and then just go in developers option then just click usb debugging as you guys can see i just click on usb debugging and after that just click home whatever you want to do here just turn it off and i hope you guys know that you need an unlock bootloader to do this whole process so now just connect this usb cable and yeah just connect this usb cable to your phone like this real quick and as you guys can see here it's just been connected okay it's been connected and i'll just switch the screen to my laptop okay as you guys can see here this has been connected and now just go ahead and open this mi i'm a flash folder kenzo and don't worry all the links will be in the description down below to download this folder i will directly upload this folder to the google drive and share the link with you all guys and this is the recovery the stock recovery as you guys can see here this is stock recovery this is the adb drivers and yeah just now just press shift and right click at the same time and just click open command window here okay and after that as you guys can see here this is flash folder kenzo just type adb devices so to make ensure that your device is connected and it's communicating with your laptop as well and now just type here adb reboot bootloader adb reboot bootloader it will automatically reboot in the bootloader as you guys can see here on my redmi note 3 it's showing fast boot mode and yeah please don't worry all the commands will be listed in the description down below step wise for example first step is adb devices second step is adb reboot bootloader and the third step is just type fast boot devices devices to check that your device is connected yeah here it is fast boot devices and now just type fast boot flash recovery and the recovery name that is okay that is stock okay okay guys so i just did one mistake i just kept this stock recovery in my pc in this folder so i'll just change to twrp recovery in just a few seconds so I'll just keep this part as soon as possible okay so as you guys can see we are back again and don't worry I just changed this recovery and just type fast boot flash recovery t t t t t w r p dot i m g just hit enter and as you guys can see a target reported max downloading size of this 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 and it's saying finished it's saying finished as you guys can see here now to ensure that your twrp is installed in your lap in your redmi note 3 just type here adb reboot yeah adb oh sorry uh, not this command just type fast boot reboot so it will just reboot your device as soon as possible as you guys can see here my mi note 3 redmi note 3 is being rebooted and i'm skipping the rebooting part so you guys just don't need to wait for this huge minute okay so as you guys can see here we are rebooted into our recovery and i will just show you by entering the passcode because i'm running the developer rom and it does not allows me to unlock my fingerprint on the first boot so i'm just entering the password right there okay the password okay here you go my phone is unlocked now just come back to a pc or you can al also do by this i'll just show you just go in update our app and yeah just disconnect this because your work is done on the pc so you just don't need to do here 
just go in update your app and just don't ignore this update guys right now okay I hope you guys can see here real quick just tap these three dots and then just click reboot okay just focus it's not more admin or three so yeah reboot to recovery mode just click reboot now and after that it will just reboot to the TWRP or the team win recovery project okay so as you guys can see here we are rebooted into the TWRP and just don't worry if this comes like this just click on cancel and then just clip this skip this like this and here we go we are in the TWRP recovery project in our Redmi Note 3 running Qualcomm edition and this audio is via this blue snowball ice microphone so please tell me how is the audio real quick and as you guys can see here we are in the system and please don't mind this arrow I just don't know why it's coming but as you guys can see here we are in the system and everything is accessible with this you can do very much thing like um, uh, installing the android 7.0 cyanogen mode on the official rom in the redmi note 3 with this twrp recovery so i hope you got how to do this whole thing so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and if you didn't you know what to do and if you guys have any questions regarding the same do ask me in the comment section down below i will definitely reply you as soon as possible so as usual this is bushan signing off and i hope to see you in my next one you guys have a great day